Hi, my name's Gemma Perry and welcome to Mooncake, where ESL teaching is made easy. If you're an ESL teacher teaching online or abroad and you're looking to improve your teaching skills, then make sure you subscribe below and hit that notification bell for weekly ESL teaching tips. Also, real quick, if you are new here, say hi in the comments below and let me know where in the world you're teaching. So, you've just finished an activity, the kids are laughing, they're smiling, they've had lots of fun, but you need to get their focus back on you so that you can move on to the next activity. And one way we can do this is with an attention grabber. Now, previously I have posted a video sharing 10 fun attention grabbers, so if you haven't, make sure you check that video out after this one, linked below. Now, you guys seem to really like that video, so today I'm sharing 10 more attention grabbers that you can try in your class. Now, before trying these attention grabbers, it's really important that you practice them with your students whilst you have their attention. This is so that they recognise these prompts when their focus is elsewhere. Anyway, without further ado, let's get started. Hi ho, hi ho. I did fall uh -huh. off, I did, but it's, it's all the way we go. go. Everybody rock! A little bit came out, it was not so much, was it? Everybody, everybody, everybody roll. roll! Chica, chica. This is what I do in my... Just keep swimming. That's what I mean, you know. Swimming, swimming. Surf's up. I don't know, but I've been told. So yeah, kind of like I can't three is mighty bold. Macaroni cheese. Everybody freeze! If you want to be an owl, say hoo hoo. Hands on top. That means stop. So there you have it, 10 attention grabbers that you can try with your students in your class. If you like this video, then go ahead and hit that like button and comment with the word helpful in the comments below. If you're looking for some more teaching tip ideas, then make sure you check out some of my other videos right here. That's it for this video, thanks so much for watching. You can find me on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter, or if you're looking for some teacher resources such as flashcards or PPT presentations, then make sure you check out the Mooncake English webpage linked below. Other than that, make sure you hit that subscribe button and notification bell for more weekly ESL teaching tips from Mooncake.